Hello and welcome to Firefighting in Canada this week. It's Friday, March 10, 2017. Today's edition is brought to you by VFIS, a division of CVIS Incorporated, Canada's largest insurer of firefighters. I'm Tamara Teek and here are the top stories. Labour and management clash in Montreal over cuts. The City of Guelph in Ontario wants a judicial review of an arbitrated three-year 7.47% wage increase for its firefighters. And British Columbia expands its presumptive legislation to include more types of cancer. Management in Montreal says the fire department is providing an acceptable level of service despite budget cuts over the last three years. Two apparatus and 40 operational firefighters were cut from the 2017 budget, along with five public education officers. The union says the cuts put firefighters and public safety at risk. The fire department budget has dropped to $328 million this year from $351 million in 2016. The department has been without a fire chief since September and is having a tough time attracting candidates. The City of Guelph is challenging an arbitration panel's decision to give firefighters higher pay than its police officers. The City wants a judicial review of the 7.47% wage increase. The three-year contract expires in 10 months and also includes a 1.99% increase in benefits. As of July, the base salary for a first-class Guelph firefighter will be more than $97,000. A judicial review does not necessarily mean the award will be changed. Firefighters who get breast cancer, prostate cancer or multiple myeloma will have an easier time getting compensation from WorkSafe BC. Those cancers were added this week to the list of presumptive occupational diseases for career and volunteer firefighters. Firefighters from across BC had gathered at the Legislature Monday to honour 14 colleagues who died in the line of duty. The BC Professional Firefighters Association had lobbied for breast cancer, prostate cancer and multiple myeloma to be recognized as presumptive diseases. That's our show for now from Annex Business Media's Niche TV Newsroom. Thank you to our sponsor, VFIS. On behalf of all of us here at Niche TV, thanks for watching.